Hey guys, welcome to another lunchtime review. Today I'm going to try one of the Stouffer's Mac and Macaroni and Cheese with Broccoli Meals. This one's freshly made pasta in a real cheddar cheese sauce with broccoli, no preservatives. It is um, 12 ounces or 340 grams. We bought these at Kroger, $2.50. I don't think that's too awfully bad. Um, I'm sure they sell them everywhere, but Kroger just happens to be where we found them. Um, it is, get it to focus, go away autofocus. Um, it's 420 calories for the meal, and there's your other information for you. And we do this in the microwave, of course. Uh, probably has oven directions somewhere. I don't see it. Yeah, right here. There's your oven directions if you want. Of course, we don't do ovens. We do microwaves, but there they are if you want them. So we're going to cut the film to vent, cook on high for four minutes, stir, recover, then cook for an additional two minutes. And be careful because it's hot, um, like it should be. So let's see what it looks like. Um, that's a decent amount of macaroni, and they threw in some broccoli to just say it's healthy. So I'm going to cut a couple slits in this and get it in the microwave, and uh, I'll be back. All right, so here it is out of the microwave. I'm just going to give it a quick stir real good. Steam is definitely rising from this stuff. I've tried to keep the broccoli a little separate, but um, it's already got cheese all over it. So, I mean, really, there's no way to avoid it. So, you don't get a lot of broccoli, though. It's mostly macaroni and cheese. Like I said, it seems like they just threw the broccoli in there to say it's a little healthier. But it's probably all of two full sprigs, not even two full, probably one full sprig of broccoli. And, and you really don't even get a lot of fl the florets. You get like two. Like there's one, there's one, and there's one, and that's it. So, so anyway. I'll be back once it's cooled off and, and uh, give it a try. I, I gave it just a few minutes to cool off. I'm actually try a, a piece of the broccoli. Like I said, it's covered in cheese anyway, so it's not like I can avoid getting the mac and cheese in there. It's still very hot. I stuck my fork through this stem right here. It seemed pretty uh, crispy. Hmm. You know, it's crunchy, but it's not like raw crunchy it is it is a little undercooked but it's not like raw so if you don't like like crunchy broccoli at all like i prefer it a little smushier but if you don't mind it a little crunchy then it's good the flavors are good i mean it tastes like broccoli with cheese with cheese sauce on it Macaroni and cheese is your typical banquet mac and cheese you've had in, in other, any other banquet macaroni and cheese meal. It's the same thing. They've literally taken the whole macaroni and cheese meal and just taken out a little bit on the side and dumped a little bit of broccoli in there and that's it. Um, I do like it. It's not a bad meal at all. The pasta is cooked well. It's got a good texture. It's not uh, mushy or soft and um, you know it's fine. Um, it's actually cooked really well the way I like it. It does, the cheese does have a little graininess to it, like um, like a powdered cheese kind of always does, and I would assume they're using some kind of processed or powdered cheese. Um, it has that grainy kind of texture to it. The broccoli, like I said, the broccoli is fine. It's just broccoli. When you mix it with the cheese, it does taste better, and um, it is still pretty crispy. So they've, they've, they've cooked it and not just blanched it, like thrown it in hot water and that's it. Um, they have cooked it a little bit, but it's still not really, really tender, like I would have it on like a casserole or something me personally um so it's good it's just not this is one of those meals that it's gonna fill you up and it's gonna be a good meal but it's not gonna be like an excellent meal you're not gonna be like wow that was, was so good when you get done with it you're just gonna go yeah it's pretty decent and go on so i'm gonna give it a three out of five i do think it's worth trying out if this sounds good to you if you like a cheesy broccoli which i do um i think you'll like it i wish there was a little more broccoli in there and it was I can even deal with the, the way it was cooked. I wish there was more of it. If you're gonna say it's macaroni and cheese with broccoli, have a little bit more broccoli to it. Cause it's definitely not the amount they show on the box. It's much smaller than that. So, um, so yeah, hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching.